you will understand better the concept of subrogation and reimbursement right and when the third party uh, will have a right to subrogation reimbursement uh, I will give you an illustration but take note ha huh? if the party has an interest in the fulfillment of the obligation right irrespective of whether the payment made by the third party was with or without the consent of the debtor the third party will have a right to subrogation that is legal subrogation in article 1301 so please take note of it okay so we are not uh, taking into consideration the third party who has an interest in the fulfillment of the obligation but this illustration is more on the effect of uh, a third party who does not have an interest in the obligation